Hey everyone, welcome to Man Cave Insider. I'm Dennis, thank you so much for joining me. If you like what you see, make sure you subscribe to our channel so you can see past and future videos. We are here in my man cave, and this room is filled with things I've collected my entire life, and these are the stories behind them. And today, we are gonna be taking a look at the 20th anniversary super deluxe version of U2's landmark album, All That You Can't Leave Behind. And I have the Super Deluxe box set, which is on five CDs. It features 51 tracks, four and a half hours of music. It has the complete album remastered, B-sides, outtakes, alternative versions, remixes, and a live recording of the Elevation Live concert from Boston in 2001. Throughout the 90s, U2 experimented with electronic dance music and alternative rock with such releases as Octung Baby, Zuropa, and Pop. After the poor reception of Pop, which was made to meet the deadline of the opening date of the Pop Mark tour, Edge later stated that this was a natural time for the band to reboot for the 21st century and the new millennium. They wanted to take a back-to-basics approach of the simplicity of a band in a room playing together. The album was produced by longtime collaborators Brian Eno and Daniel Lanois, who insisted that the band write much of the material in the studio. The original title of the album was U2000 and was eyed for a 1999 release, but the band wanted to wait till the material was worthy of an album for the new millennium. Bono wrote the song Stuck in a Moment You Can't Get Out of for his dear friend Michael Hutchins of NXS who had committed suicide in 1997. The album cover and the first video for A Beautiful Day were shot at Charles de Gaulle Airport in Paris. The cover features a photograph of the band, bags in hand, getting ready to go on a flight. On the left side of the album cover is a display with the letters J33-3, which is a verse in the Bible, Jeremiah 33-3, which reads, Call unto me, and I will answer thee great and many things which thou knowest not, which Bono viewed as the phone number to God. The title, All That You Can't Leave Behind, refers to taking everything from your past and present and bringing it forward into the future. The album went to number one in 32 countries and sold over 12 million albums worldwide and yielded four singles for Beautiful Day, Walk On, Stuck in a Moment You Can't Get Out Of, and Elevation, which was also used in the film Lara Croft Tomb Raider, starring Angelina Jolie. All That You Can't Leave Behind won seven Grammy Awards and is the only album in music history to have more than one song win for Record of the Year with Beautiful Day in 2001 and Walk On in 2002. This album reintroduced and revitalized U2 as one of the most important bands in the 20th and now 21st century. When U2 toured in the 90s, it saw Mammoth Productions with the Zoo TV and Pop Mart tours, but the Elevation Tour decided to take a more scaled back approach and bring U2 back into the arenas. The centerpiece of the stage was a heart-shaped runway that went into the middle of the audience. The Pop Mart Tour put U2 in the Guinness Book of World Records for the largest video screen of all time, but this tour featured four smaller screens, each one focused on a different member of the band for the entire show. The Elevation Tour went on to gross $143 million and was the top tour of 2001. This was also the first time that I ever got to see U2 live was on this tour in Anaheim, California. This is a transformative album for the band, which took everything from the 80s and the 90s and brought U2 into the 21st century, and they have continued to put out some of their best material ever since, with albums such as How to Dismantle an Atomic Bomb, No Line on the Horizon, and Songs of Innocence and Experience, and many more to come. Beautiful Day has been a mainstay of u two set list ever since, and to be perfectly honest, I even had it played in the beginning of my own wedding video. And I'm very excited to finally have this super deluxe box set, along with the DVD release of the show from 2001 in Boston. 
So let's go ahead and let's take a look at the super deluxe box set of All That You Can't Leave Behind. Here it is, U2 All That You Can't Leave Behind Super Deluxe CD Box Set. It comes in this hard case. On the back, it lists the contents. And on the side of it, it says, the only baggage that you can bring is all that you can't leave behind. The case itself is super glossy. And it's got some lyrics from some of the songs on it. So inside, this is the cover of the album that was shot in Charles de Gaulle Airport. And you could see J33-3, which is the verse from Jeremiah in the Bible. It's got a listing of the contents of all the CDs. So it's got first CD, All That You Can't Leave Behind Remastered. Then it's got B-sides, outtakes, and alternatives. Two CDs, live, elevation tour from Boston, and then one CD of exclusive remixes. There are a couple of things on the inside. First is a double-sided poster with the lyrics from the song and then the back it has another poster with a picture of the band and the title of the album it has the book of photos lyrics to all the songs a lot of great singles from this walk on beautiful day Stuck in a moment you can't get out of, Elevation. It's also got a lot of other great songs such as Grace, Kite, New York. It's really one of my favorite U2 albums. And they really knocked it out of the park with this one. And this would be the same booklet that would come with the 9 LP version. And then... It's got this hardcover book, Walk On, a travelogue by longtime YouTube documentarian Anton Corbin. And this has a lot of unreleased photos of the band from this time period. What I love about getting physical media, especially nowadays, is you can't replicate this digitally. You can look at this on a picture on a computer. Uh, you can listen to the songs either downloaded or streaming, but just to physically have all of this in your hand while listening to the music, it's something that never goes away. And this set is certainly a testament to that. And I haven't had a chance to read any of this yet because I just opened it but if you're a fan of the band and especially this album you know it's definitely something you should get for your collection you two have put out some box sets of previous works they put out a super deluxe set like this for the Joshua Tree a few years ago and I'm hoping that they put one out for Octone Baby which is coming up on its 30th anniversary fairly soon. So again, this is the All That You Can't Leave Behind Super Deluxe box set. 51 tracks, four and a half hours of music. So that is it for our look at the 20th anniversary box set of U2 All That You Can't Leave Behind. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe to our channel, and we look forward to seeing you next time.